hello welcome back to another vlog it's patra if you're new hello if you're out welcome back so i'm currently about to go out to her store to buy some extensions i'll buy the long expression and the curly hair and when i come back i'll start taking down my current hairstyle here's my sister guys we've never met her before hi guys say hi true <laughs> let's go let's go My favorite expression this one I'm gonna get I'm gonna get three three I want even want your extension to be a bit long I recommend this one impression I know you have I know you've seen expression but impression and I feel like impression is so much better so I'm going to this extension I'm choosing a crochet one to crochet in the braids I'm going to choose um, water wave so my sister have said that my, what mom made is also the same as okay. Bohemian braid. Bohemian. Bohemian Bohemian braids, mermaid braids, boohoo braids, they're all the same. <laughs> yeah, basically. Like <laughs> so basically, yeah, I'm choosing crochet braids now and I'm going to go for impression, but this is the last one they have, so I'm going to choose something similar to this. Okay, I'm back from the hair store now and I'm going to take down my mini twist. This is what it looks like very very tiny very tiny so i need to take my time to do this and after this i'm going to wash my hair do conditioner it and start braiding it's literally 3 38 a.m and i just finished on doing my mini twists like it was so tiny but now i'm going to just brush my face brush my mouth and go to bed because it's too late morning so I'm going to detangle my hair now. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and also comment down below which hairstyle you currently have on and which hairstyle you're going to do next. Will you be the one braiding your hair or are you going to a hairdresser? section my hair and now I'm gonna wash it in the shower. I'm going to use this anti Jackie's moisturizing and softening shampoo. Sometimes I do apply oil on my hair before I shampoo to make my hair softer. And to do conditioner, I'm going to use the ORS olive oil replenishing conditioner and mix it with this armor armor oil together. This makes my hair really soft. Honestly, this time, if you want to try it, try it. This, I feel like this is the best conditioner I've ever used and I'm going to buy another big bottle once it's finished. So yes, I'm going to mix these two and deep conditioning on my hair. This con and leave it for, um, for 40 minutes, 45 minutes an hour. While my hair is deep conditioning in the shower cup, um, I'm going to stretch my extension. I'm, I'm using impression. This, so there's the difference between these extensions. There's impression and there's expression. I prefer impression because impression makes, when you braid your hair, makes your hair really flowy and I really like that. So trust me, this is a good quality. But well, before you cut extension and stretch extension, you need to you need to know how long you want your hair. So my hair, I want this, I want my hair a bit like touching my back. I want it touching my back. So I think I'm gonna cut this in three. If you want it shorter, this is how you, you this is how you cut it. So you cut it like one, and make sure it's equal one, and that would be two. So if you cut this here, cut that there, that's two, three, half. We have two of this, and I'm going to stretch, stretch this. And all you just need to do is. Like this. I can't explain it. I can't explain it. I can only show you. So this is how you stretch your extension. Like that. So 
So grip the hair like this. It's like it's like a certain amount of money. It's like a certain amount of money. One, two, three. It's literally like that. This is what the stretch hair looks like. Before I comb it, I will just supreme them like this. And also keep gripping, keep gripping the hair like that, you know, so that it's going to be much easier for you to to come back. Obviously, you're going to do some hair while you're doing this, but you see how I've just done this, and all the tangles is at the end of it. I'm gonna add this. Normally, I add like a leave-in conditioner, but I don't have a leave-in conditioner, so I add this cream. Care. You can add anything. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And you brush it from the brain, obviously, just like you're brushing your natural hair. Done. And when you're done with one hair, you wrap it around like that in circles, like you're tying a bag. It wouldn't tangle, by the way. Um, so I've been doing my hair since Wednesday. So I do my hair on Wednesday and um, this is how far I've gone. And I'm going to show you how I've done this. My hair is already washed and cleaned and moisturized. So I'm not adding any gel. I'm not adding anything to my scalp. I'm going to pat this section into... I'm going to pat it into... I'm going to use two, just two extensions for this one. So this is right now. I'm going to use that. Like this, cross it over, bring it together, hold it this way, grab it like that, like this, this one, which is closer. I'll start with this one here. I don't know if you could see what I'm doing. So once I've noticed that, once I've noticed that um, I'm braiding like all my hair, my natural hair together with the extension, I'll, I'll add this one now. I want the extension to be out, the other end of the extension, like this, there, hold it on. braided the extension, braided it to the almost the end and I'm gonna add another oily extension to this. So I'll do it exactly like I did the other one. Put it there. what it looks like with this is what it looks like um, with this color extension you can put it in any specific place you can put it up there you can put it there there but sometimes I've been putting it towards the end so that it kind of is kind of together with the expression by the way this is water wave I'm using water wave It's Sunday, I finished my hair. I finished my hair on Saturday. Um, so this, this is the finished look. So what I've done is like, I've separated the impression, the braiding extension from the water wave, the curly extension. So I can did the braiding extension in hot water. 
and not ruin the curls of the waterway. I don't have curling rod, so I'm gonna use this. This is a um, foil. I wrapped it around into cylinder kind of shape. I actually saw this on TikTok and I thought this is actually great because I know you can actually curl your hair with a braiding method, but I don't like the braiding method so. Dip this in hot water. I don't want to burn myself, okay? Oof, okay. Dry it, dry it. Oh, so hot. I'm going to let this dry and then take it off. I'm going to dry it with my hair dryer. So I'm going to take this out. Please be nice. Please be. Ooh. Look, look at the corals. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm going to separate the corals. Okay, since I can't put all my hair in hot water, I'm just going to soak this in hot water and kind of wrap it around the braiding extension so it's because so it becomes less stiff. See so hot water. I need to be careful because I don't want to burn myself. Woo! Woo chow! Ah, ah. Okay. <laughs> <I'm> so dramatic. <laughs> okay. Add some news and trim the curly hair. See um my hair trimmed it up. This is it. All I just did was I kind of trimmed it with a wig and curly hair to meet the braiding extension. And I really like it. What do you think? If you really want to add some edges control, you can, but I'm just gonna leave my hair the way it is because I don't want to add any edge control right now <laughs> until I'm going out and this brings me this brings me to the end of this video if you enjoy it don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below if you're going to try this hairstyle and if you like it I'll see you in my next video bye